try to use for an illustration here. The water feels so good about ankle. It's going back in two. Uh -huh. Run up the play and hit it. Right, right. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Waves come in every now and then they get up about right there and just smack you real good. <laughs> but we don't want to go no farther. Come on. We got to get out. Yeah. Out to where you can't even touch the bottom. God, I live, breathe, and have my What's that? What was Ezekiel saying? You got to trust him. That's right. When you get out there, see, a lot of times we're. I don't like getting in the natural. I like feeling that bottom. <laughs> okay? Yeah. If you're like that in the natural, that's all right. But what I'm trying to say is, let's get out there and trust Jesus. Amen. I'm not telling you in the natural out there you can't swim. Jesus is out when you're going under. Where you at, Jesus? That's carnal. Amen. But I'm talking about in the spirit. Let's grow in the spirit. Follow Jesus in the spirit. Watch where we, it don't matter if you can swim or not. You get out in the spirit in the deep. Right. God take you in the deep places you've never been. Oh, He'll take yeah. you and lay hands on somebody yes, and cast devils out. He'll take you, lay hands on somebody and heal them with come. He'll take you, but God, if you will get with Jesus and follow him, he'll take you places that man can never take you. Right. Who are we following? Man, I only take us so far. Uh -huh. Pastor can only take them so far. Oh, right. But people's got to have a pastor. That's the message. Amen. Come on. You got to have a pastor. That's right. People don't agree with that. Come on. It's part of it. Or part of it, he wasn't put in the book. That's right. That's right. So who are we following in our church? Jesus. Jesus. Come on. Amen. We follow Jesus. Yes, sir. Are there room for all of us to come up hither? Amen. 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 There's room for us to come right on up to the house. Amen. Hallelujah. So he's always telling them. You don't hear a lot of it. Casting out devils. There's people who's pumped full of the devil. Amen. Oh, God. There's people who's pumped full of the devil. You got that right. We'll just walk around and look at them. Go on. God bless you. Don't look and say, well, they got to want to be cast out. That's something that the devil himself come up with. Yeah. Because when Jesus comes, he asks, don't cast me out. Don't say, well, if he's willing, then, then you cast him out. We got power over him. I've heard that statement. Well, when it's willing, it'll come out. He ain't never going to be willing to come out. He wants to stay right in there. That's right. He wants to kill and destroy that person. That's his goal. That's why God's placed us in the body. So we need to start following him. What he says to do, what he commands to do, he says if you love me, keep my commandments. That's one of them. That's right. Take up your cross and follow me daily. That's right. Not two days a week, but one day a week. Some of them's two, two days a month. Yeah. Come on. Some of one a month. Come on. Come on. Once a year. Amen. Some of them once a year. Easter and Christmas. Easter and Christmas. There you go. And I'm not against them if they come out on those days. Right. I got my chance to preach to them. Amen. Come on. 